My name is Jo Stevens. I'm class teacher at Torrington Bluecoat Primary School and I started the town task force. A year ago, I decided to start a group um, to work within the community involving the parents of the children from school. So initially, we'd started working with the parents and there was only four or five children and it's grown since then. We've got nine children involved now and we do lots of different projects in the town involving the children in activities that are going on in their local community. Um, the first project was at the town library. Um, Kate had asked us to design and create a display board to encourage some of the people who use the library to read. So the town task force got together and looked at what our favourite books were, why we liked reading, what we liked about reading, and they came up with a summary display using bees and butterflies and flowers, and they hung their book reviews from a washing line and wrote about how fun reading is and how everybody should be involved in reading and rent out a book. And it's still there. Almost a year later, it's still in the library. There's a group of us children in Year 5 and we basically help our town, which is Great Tryington, to like, so when, it's in, when we're in the future, um, our, lives is, our lives are a bit easier because we've helped them back in the past and basically um, we don't do it anywhere else, we just do it in the town to help other people and us to like make the town better and like stronger when it's a bit like down so we've done like lots of projects on it and lots of people have been asking us and we've got more po popular the more we've like done it and the more we've like told people about it. My favourite project was the library because um, we got to do lots of light art and colouring because we had these um, we had these butterflies, what we were colouring in, and our own designs. And we also um, had sheets of paper of um, what books were our favourite and um, why. And yeah, and we put them on our display. My favourite pro project was the um, making the Grinch Ruffs, um Christmas lanterns. Um, we made them by it was either a the bottom of a plastic bottle or a glass jar and we made them by putting yellow orange or red strips around them and a fake candle in the middle my favorite project was doing a display in the library um we made the display look really colorful um we put our like the name of our school on in colourful letters and we did a rainbow and we did book reviews on a washing line and butterflies and made it look really colourful and Kate who works in the library said that people always comment on it. I like I liked doing the um making the bins um I like I would like to make them again because they were really fun to make because I really like doing arts and crafts and I think it would help the town a bit more if we had a few more bins because a lot of people leave litter around so it would help the town to like not be like a litter dump place to clean up. My favorite project was the bins because when we were making them it was actually quite funny because my sister joined in when we were doing it and we made like this really gooey thing for Rowan's and it looked really funny and it's got like these floppy ears hanging off. Um, well I designed my bin um, like a um, rubbish monster that um, when you put the recycling in you like put it in his mouth and he would eat it. My favourite project was going to the food bank to like sort out the food because um, it was like really interesting to like see what how much food and what food they gave like the poor people of Torrington. Um, so the food bank is like 
um, a thing that's like me, it's in the church um, in Torrington and um, basically so say if the poor people can't like afford to get um, the food that they want they would go to the food bank and they the food bank people would like give the food to them so they wouldn't have to like starve or be poor. I live in the town and work in the town and I think it's really important that the children from the school are involved in the town and make decisions towards the town and not feel like because they're children they don't necessarily have a voice so that was part of the reason for setting it up I wanted the children to feel that they were part of the town that they live in and that they can help towards improving the town that they're living and make a make a um, make a mark on their town for the future. I think it's really important that they feel like they've got a voice and they are part of their local community. We have helped the community um, to like make the town a bit better and like just because we're children it doesn't mean we're like useless. We can help the town. The children that we've got in the town task force have a multitude of talents. Some of them are really creative and artistic and have been really enthusiastic at designing the display for the library, for example. And some of them are really quite methodical and strategic and they were working out plans on how they can help out at the food bank. So they, they a diverse bunch of children really that have lots of different talents and we use all of them in the town task force and it's great to know that these children with these talents are helping out in the town. It's really important that they feel valued. Lots of us have really good ideas that we like to share with people. We also like to help our community. We don't like to just leave it to the adults to do. We like to make our town a better place so people in the future can have a bit of a better life. Most of the activities that the town task force do are either at the weekends or after school or sometimes they're in school holidays. We rely upon their parents to help out. It's definitely um, a joint venture between the school and the town and the task force and the parents. Um, so it's usually outside of school hours. We all really like to help our town, so we like getting involved in lots of things that we do around the town because like, there's lots of people that want us to help them, so we come to help them and we like doing that. We're always looking for new projects to work on. So if anybody has anything that they would like some help with, anybody involved in the town at all, we have many skills. We've just helped distribute leaflets and flyers for the Plough Youth Theatre. So we can help out with distributing leaflets or handing out questionnaires, which is something that we did for the Calf Street Regeneration Project. We could help with cleaning and tidying, which we did for the town tidy up before Mayfair. We're very creative. We can do lots of creative things. Anything that anybody wants to be done on a Saturday morning or during holidays or after school, we would love to hear from you. Just got to get in touch with us at school.